Alright, box set. <laughs> Zero Eleven here, and today we got the 1920 Upper Deck MVP Retail Box Set. This is the second year Upper Deck has done the MVP Box Set. So what you get in the box set? The 250 card base set. But it's either the blue parallel or the rare silver script parallel. For reference, here's a normal 1920 MVP base card. Also, here's a silver script, so we'll use that for reference. But what do you call this color? It's kind of like a greenish, tealish color. But the cards that come in here should be blue. On top of getting the 250 card base set, which cards from 200 to 250 are short prints, and there's 30 rookies, you also get one bonus pack inside. Now in the back, it doesn't say anything about odds of getting the silver script box, but I would assume it's like a box set case hit. I would assume it's like one in 20 boxes. That's my guess. But yeah, I'm mostly curious in the bonus pack. Of course, there's some solid carryover rookies in here. So yeah, let's check out this 1920 Upper Deck MVP box set. And before I forget, this box cost 35 bucks Canadian, right around there. Your best pals will have it for like 40 something. But yeah, I did not get this from your best pals. Of course, there's a little piece of tape there. All right. And yes, the box is quite a bit bigger than last year's. Got some padding for that, but oh, there's the uh, bonus pack. Let me just put that to the side there. I'll save that to the end. And let's take out this uh, padding here. It's interesting they went with the bigger box. There's the other padding. So that leaves us just with the base set. And it looks like it's blue. But let me take it out here. All right, the cards are out. And wait, hold on here. So the top card here is number 113. I did not mess these up either. 56. 76. 99. Okay then. I guess they're not neatly in order this year. Maybe it's just this box. I don't know. I'll, uh go through these anyways so so here's the blue parallel and comparing that to the regular one the blue does look nice but in general i do like the look of mvp this year <laughs> but yeah it looks like the cards are in no order at all which is absolutely bizarre i mean don't know why that is like let's see well, this card is number six the card's number 26 like I don't get it at all, 194. So this is just the base set from 1920 MVP. Evgeny Kuznetsov. You got Brock Besser, so this is just the regular cards. I don't think there's any short prints here. But yeah, nothing overly tremendous here. And we got the checklist here, that's kind of weird. Card number 100 is sitting here. Let me guess, Riddick is not 101. He's 122. They're all over the place, which is bizarre. Thomas, da, da. I don't know why it's they're just all over the place. 73, it's 179. So weird, I don't know. And then McKinnon's number 12. That's kind of crazy he's not a short print. So there's that. Let me continue to go through these cards that are not in order. Oh, there's Danny. Brooks Orpic. Uh there's a blue of Carter Hart. So, yeah. They're all out of whack, which is kind of unfortunate. I'm going to have to put it in order myself, which sucks. But, yeah. Just the base set. There we go. Just the base set. Uh, oh, there's Phil. All right. So, I'll just breeze right through these. Hopefully, I didn't miss a short print or anything. I don't think so. Two correct. I'm stopping on those players. D boss. All right, I'll stop. Okay. So yeah, these aren't the short prints. Yeah. So this is just the base. Yeah, just the base set. Yeah. Oh, here's the checklist. Here we go. This is number 200. There's 101 to 200. Let me guess. That's not number 201. Where is number 201? Say again? No. Uh, I don't know. This is weird. Cahoon has a base card. I didn't know that. Huh, okay. So I haven't even made it to the short prints yet. Jeez, but there's all over the place. At least isn't even a short print, huh? Well, there you go. Just a whole lot of base. I don't even know what to make of this. This is just a big mess. I don't know if I got a messed up box 
I don't know. I got it from a reputable place. I don't know. This is weird. Do we got some short prints finally here? No? Ah. So bizarre. Oh, there we go. We got a rookie finally. We got a Zadina rookie. So there's Philip Zadina rookie. That's card number 223. The first rookie. Hopefully all the rookies are in here. Murder's a short print. So there you go. There's another short print. Got Mackenzie McEachern, another rookie. Pacioretty, is he a short print? Yeah, he's a short print, 211. We got Teddy Bluger. There we go, we got some rookies here. Max Jones. Flurry, who's probably a short print. Quinn Hughes, rookie. I don't know if there's any value to that. I don't even know if there's any comparables right now for the blue MVP rookie of Quinn Hughes. Got Henrik Lundqvist. Got Eric Brandstrom, rookie. There's some rookies. Alexander Texier, rookie. There's Crosby, it's definitely a short print. Ryan Lindgren. Rookie, he's Charlie Lindgren's brother there. There's Dreisaitl. There's a Grundstrom, rookie. Riley Stillman, Corey Stillman's son. Steven Stamkos. Carson Kuhlman. There's Line A. Abramoff. Cole Sherwood. There's Tavares. Matt Roy. Goudreau. Jacob Middleton, rookie. Brandon Geniak, rookie. There's Max Domi. Philippe Myers, rookie. There's Carey Price, definitely a short print. Libor Hayek. There's Colin Blackwell. He was a 7th rounder in 2011, so... Good for him for making it. He's actually played some games this year as well as 6 games last year, so... He's gotten a couple points this year as well, so there you go. Blackwell. There's Matthews, definitely a short print. Zach McEwen. There's McDavid. Kevin Boyle. Trent Frederick, rookie. There's Monan. Dante Fabro, rookie. There's a Makar checklist. Should be getting a regular Makar in here. There's Ovi. Ian Brisebois. Rudolph Balsers, rookie. Patty Kane. There's Kale McCarr. Don't know if that goes for anything. Don't know if the, any of these blues go for anything, but there you go. There's a Kale McCarr MVP blue rookie right there. And Nikita Kucherov, Taro Hirose, Nathan Bastian, Joe Thornton, Ryan Paling. Another good one, but there you go. And Joel L'Esperance. So there's a base set all over the place. I saw the bonus pack, but look at that. It's just all over the place. Like, the order is so messed up. But let's check out this MVP bonus pack. Looks like we got a Western Stars pack. We got Elias there. So let's check this out. I wonder how many cards per pack is in here. Probably five. Judging by Western Stars 5 for Brent Burns there. Alright. First card for Western Stars is Elias. You got Connor McDavid. Connor McDavid. Drew Doughty, Western Stars. Johnny Goodrow, Western Stars. And Brent Burns, Western Stars. So, yeah, guys, there is a retail box set of 1920 Upper Deck MVP. Just really bizarre how the cards are all over the place. Looks like they're all there, but just weird. Ugh. So yeah guys, stay tuned for more breaks to come. And as always, thanks for watching and I'll see you guys later.